Hello friends, welcome. As promised, I have a PR video to share with you. I have lots of PR boxes that I received in the last couple of weeks. I haven't been able to film them, so I am going to show you everything I got so far. It's quite a few, so I'll try to do as fast as I can so this video isn't too long. But the first thing I wanna show you is I got something from Bobbi Brown. It, I got the Longwear Cream Liner Stick in the shade Panther Matte and also in the shade Forest. I'm not gonna go in any like particular order, just I have all the boxes stacked here on my right side and I'm just gonna be getting them as I go. So these are the sticks. Ooh, they look like crayons. Well, this one doesn't. This one is the liner stick in the shade Panther. Let's see how that looks. Oh yes, it's creamy. And then we have shadow stick in the shade of forest. Oh, this one has like a little bit of green there and it's metallic. Really pretty. I have I have a few shades of this stick and they are long wearing and they don't budge. My eyelids tend to be a little bit oily in comparison to my face which is dry. So I am really excited about this color because I love brown and greens. So very nice. Thank you, Bobby Brown, for sending these my way. I got a couple of things from YSL. I got two shades of the two Chaclat Radiant Touch. I got the shade one and the shade O or zero. The shade zero is the, Le the Luminous Milk and the shade one is the Luminous Radiance. But I do want to show you the products and they are they have you know the the brush and then you just pump it from the bottom so thank you YSL and also from YSL they sent me four shades of their love shine high shine carrying lipstick I had these on my wish list for the Sephora sale but when I saw that I was getting them because they emailed me when I saw that I was getting them I, was, I took them off the cart because I was very curious about these, these lip shines I do have some of the YSL lipstick bombs and it's one of my favorite lip products so of course I was excited about this new launch that I thought the this color here was gonna be like a reference to what the lipstick was gonna be but no that's just the design so let's swatch these first let's take a look at the packaging or how they look Yes, I have that scent that I love. That peachy scent. So I'm gonna swatch all of them. Oh, it's so balmy. Okay, so from top to bottom, I think that'll be easier. Look how beautiful they are. From top to bottom, we have shade 211, which is Ardent Carmine. Then we're followed by number 202, Peachy Glow. Then we have 200 rosy sand and then last but not least we have number 44 nude lavalier and i don't know if they watch my videos or if they know what kind of shades they like but these shades are all, all up on my alley because i love i love those orangey reds and i do love nudes as well beautiful and i love the way they smell <laughs> so good thank you ysl for both the lipsticks and the uh, concealers Okay, the next thing I want to show you is from IT Cosmetics. I did see this in Sephora as well. The IT, IT Cosmetics Hello Sunshine Invisible Hydrating Serum Sunscreen with SPF 50. I'm always down for trying new sunscreens, so thank you IT Cosmetics for sending it my way. It has 1% Pro Vitamin B5 plus Hyaluronic Acid and helps protect and prime. So, so this is what the packaging looks like. I'll try it out and let you guys know what I think. Thank you, It Cosmetics. So next is from a brand that I recently discovered. It's Sweet Beauty. They reached out to me, which was surprising, and asked me if I wanted to try some other products. And of course, I said yes. I think their packaging is really pretty, and green is my favorite color. It's like a minty green, but still. They sent me over their Pro Eyelash Serum, and they sent me... Pro Lash Lift Mascara in Black, a Satin Coal Eyeliner in Dusty Brown, brown, and a Lip Liner in the shade Classic Red. 
they announced on Instagram recently they have a new product with Lydia Millen, which I love Lydia. So I'm excited for that as well. Okay, so I'm not gonna swatch serum, but here's the serum and here's the mascara. I'm gonna leave it for a video because I don't wanna open it just yet. And I'm gonna swatch both the lip liner and the eyeliner. Look how pretty that is. Let's take a look at the it's all it's a pencil, it's like the ones you sharpen. Which I actually I like both, but I kind of prefer this one sometimes. I think it's more hygienic. But I like the creamy ones as well, don't get me wrong. The color is really pretty. They're not as gliding as other ones that I've tried, but again, I have to try it on the lids to see if they're any different. So here is the one from Sweet. And let's give a shot to the lip liner. Oh, okay, so it has the, lip, the pencil one side and then has like a little brush on the other side. And this seems like the ones you sharpen, but not like... um. Not a typical pencil. Let me show you real quick. Give it a quick swatch. Yeah, this one glides much nicer, which makes sense because it's for your lips. Look how bright and beautiful that red is. Oh, classic red. So thank you so much, Sweet Beauty. Really excited to try your products. And I have a box here from, oh, Kova Skincare. This was another brand that reached out to me. It's Koba in case you don't are not familiar with the brand. They're a skincare brand. Are they Korean? They're made in France. Anyhow, they sent me their Milky Body Lotion formulated with Safu oil. I don't I'm not familiar with Safu oil, so that's exciting. It has Safu oil, Shea butter, Baobab oil, Jojoba oil, and acetamine and alatoin. Interesting. It's a body lotion. The packaging is really pretty green again. I love green. And look at the inside, it has like animal print really pretty and it's a big product but it's 20 100 200 milliliters or 6.8 fluid ounce and this is what it looks like Let's see if it has any scent mm -hmm. let me just grab a little bit so it's milky it's like a milk milky texture and yes it smells good like like yum like shea butter and the jojoba oil and it's absorbed really quickly by my skin which is great i i don't like that feeling of lotions on the especially the body i could tolerate the face for some at some point and hands but the body i i don't like it so this seems like really really good for the body because it's absorbed really really quickly so yes thank you Koba skincare i'm gonna use this right away tonight when i shower i'm gonna put it on I was thinking the other day that since I get to try so many products and I don't have as much time to like review everything and make a video every day I'm thinking of just doing like a video a month or two videos a month which is quick reviews of products that I try so let me know if that's something that it's interesting to you so let's keep on going another skincare brand reached out to me this one is Ren Ren skincare I have tried their products before they have sent me items and I liked it this time they sent me their Radiance Eclat pH Exfoliating Facial. That's pretty. I do have dry skin like I said, so I don't exfoliate often, maybe once or twice a week. But I will give this a try, of course. It says it restores the skin's natural glow. 94% says skin is brighter and glowing. Removes impurities and busts away dead skin cells. Does not disturb the skin barrier, very important, and is suitable for sensitive skin. And this is what it looks like. I'll keep you guys posted. It says you can use it twice or three times a week, which is what I plan to do, probably once or twice. And I'll see how I'll see how that goes. I got something else from a brand I have never heard of before, and they reached out to me. I saw their Instagram, I saw their page. I liked how their products look, and I said yes, of course I'll try your products. And a couple of days after, I said yes. I started seeing like other content creators talking about it and how great it is so I'm, I'm curious now I'm really curious and the brand is flight 70 they sent me a couple of items to try it says dear hello Yanelis we're so excited for you to get to know our SOS I think it says SOS lip sheet lip sheets or lip shears I love handwritten notes they're like so personal so yes yeah, so they sent me a bunch a lipsticks 
because of the time and because of my lips i'm not gonna be swatching all of these on my lips but i will get a swatch in the back of my hand so we have an idea they sent me six lip shears okay so this is what the packaging looks like the pretty design is white and gray and it has some weight to it they are magnetic and they're made in italy and this is what one of them looks like the bullet they look matte but let's swatch and see oh they're not matte at all all right so in order now we're gonna go from top to bottom or i'm gonna start with this one it is that one's called alone it's a pretty peachy nude and then from top to bottom we have rome like r-o-a-m then we have wishing well followed by kid and then the last two we have oh l'amour <laughs> and then the last one is tempted so pretty and it's balmy not as shiny as the ysl lip balms but they are balmy and, and they look like really hydrating so and moisturizing so yes and it smells so good here they are again thank you so much fight 70 for sending me these over to me okay up next i got pr from urban decay which i cannot believe i am beyond myself they sent me this cute pr packaging you probably have seen it because i've seen a couple of content creators get it as well you probably guess what it is it's their face bond face bond triple power foundation and which is this oh this one i'm sorry and then the semi aid sponge they sent me two hair clips and this is the long setting setting spray which is one of the best setting sprays that i tried in my opinion so really excited for this especially the foundation because i'm always down for trying new foundations so thank you so much urban decay really excited for this and the packaging is so cute <laughs> i got a box from the brand in beauty oh they sent me the green machine vitamin c and super food serum the highlighting highlighting gel cream this is the pore refined pore and texture serum and the firming and lifting moisturizer and finally they sent me the bright and tight eye cream so really excited to try this brand i think i tried a couple other items um i think what i'm most excited about is a highlighting gel cream because i'm always looking for something that we're brightening up my, my skin so thank you so much in beauty i will try these out of course and let you guys know what my thoughts are Ooh, i got something from kozas i think this is the first time i get something from kozas i hope it's their foundation yes <laughs> the dream beam sunlit spf 40 it's not really a foundation i think it's more like a tinted moisturizer oh my god how cute is this they sent me like um a pillow in like the shape or the design as the, the 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 product the face product isn't that cute um i'm gonna sleep with it because i like to sleep with hugging something so my arm wouldn't fall asleep oh this is so cute so yes they sent me the dream beat sunlit comfy smooth sunscreen broad spectrum spf 40 water resistant so it, it's an spf but i think it has a tint oh there's something else there's something else in the box i hadn't realized the plump and juicy vegan collagen spray on serum oh my god this i had on my sephora wishes again i'm mentioning it again i had this in my sephora wishes but it sold out so i couldn't get it in sephora that's awesome oh i'm gonna open it because i really want to try this well i want to try both but it says this spf is protective mineral it's spf plumping hydrating strengthening and soothing and I, they sent me the shade Original Beam for a radiant finish. While the other one is for a glow. So I got the one on the left. Which makes sense because I do have lighter skin. I'm so excited for this. It's really heavy. It's made of glass. Awesome. And then here we go, the foundation. Has an expiration date of January 2026. I like when products give you an expiration date. Because it tells you, okay, six months, one year, but then you don't remember when you bought it in the first place. So you, or when you opened it in the first place, so you forget. I like this. Here it is, beautiful packaging. You see how it looks like the pillow? <laughs> 
It is adorable. So thank you so much, Kozas, for sending me these ways. So excited for it. I know I say that a lot, that I'm excited, but I really am excited. I'm dead, I'm dead tired. I, I came from work a little bit ago, but I am excited. All right, I got something from the Inky List. Yes, uh, first time I get something from them, I think. I mean, I tried their products and I love them, but it's the first time they actually send me something. I'm pure. What did they send me? Oh, their Salicylic Acid Cleanser. Salicylic. Is salicylic? I don't think salicylic is harsh on my skin. But I'll, I'll try first in a small area just in case. Thank you so much, Inky List. I got something from Jones Road. I have received products from Jones Road before. It's one of my favorite brands because they're so minimalistic. And it's just a way of, I think the way they like to do things is enhancing your natural, natural beauty. And that's what I like about them. And another handwritten note says, Hi, welcome to the JR family. Happy to have you. So now I'm in their family. What does this mean? I'm in their PR? <gasps> that's nice. I mean, I've gotten things before, but not as PR. Just like regular gifts. <gasps> that's exciting. Thank you. Jones Road, your guide to Miracle Bomb. <gasps> they sent me the new Miracle Bomb. And Dusty Rose. And Flushed. I'm not going to swatch anything right now. There's no scent. I didn't expect it to have any scent. But this is Flushed. It's a pretty pink, a little bit like a carnation pink. And then Dusty Rose, I'm thinking it's a little bit darker. Yeah, a little bit darker. Maybe this could be like a bronzer. I'll, I'll give it a try, I'll review it of course, I'll try them out. Thank you so much, Jones Road. I think they also, they sent me something else. I think it's a brush, it will make sense. Awesome. I don't have a brush by them. This is the everything brush, made in Italy. It's dense, but it's really fluffy. It's like soft, not fluffy, soft. Thank you so, so much, Jones Road, for sending me this way and for welcoming, welcoming me into your family. I got another box from It Cosmetics. Oh, this is their new confidence in a gel cream. Here you go. Ooh, it looks really refreshing. It's an eye cream, but it's pretty big. Usually I've seen eye creams to be more... In the smaller side, oh, this is an eye cream or just a regular cream? Did I read eye cream? But it's not eye cream. It's a confidence in a gel cream. Ultra light skin balancing moisturizer. It's not an eye cream. I don't know why I thought it was. This is what it looks like. And it smells really good. Like, what is it? Aloe vera? It has niacinamide. Peptide complex. Squalane, which I like. It has erlysium, zinc PSA, and PHA. Yeah, I'm not sure what all the ingredients it has, but it does smell good. It's really fresh. Reminds me of like aloe vera, cucumber, that kind of scent. Not as much as cucumber, but like very refreshing like aloe vera. I got something from Laura Mercier. Always a beautiful and nice surprise. It says, Rise and Prime, the Anelis. Introducing Laura Mercier's new pure canvas primers are secret to the perfect base behind every flawless face. And there's a handwritten note. I'm gonna read. First, I want to see what they sent me. Ooh, they sent me three primers. Did they come out with three? And then they sent me all three. I wonder, are they tinted? I don't know a lot about the, these products. Oh, there's four of them, I guess. Oh no, there is three. There's a pure canvas priming, hydrating, a blurring, and illuminating. So there are three, three types, and they sent me all three. Here they are, all three. Blurring, illuminating, and hydrating. So, of course, I'm not going to try them right now. But, you know you know what I'm going to say. I'm going to try them and let you guys know. And let me see what the written note says. It says, Hi, Yanelis. Behind each flawless face is our secret to the perfect base. That rhymes. Reintroducing Laura Mercier's new and improved pure canvas primers. The next generation of primers powered by 85% skincare ingredients that will moisturize, smooth, and protect your skin to keep you in your prime. The results, the perfect canvas as step one of your flawless face routine. Bizu, the Laura Mercier team. Thank you so much. I got a box from Lawless. Ooh, they sent me their Forget the Filler Gloss. They sent me all shades. We included the following. Best selling shades for you to try. There's like six of them. Seven of them. That is so generous. Here they are. Oh, and it comes with a mirror. Look how cute. A little heart mirror. Um, lip mirror. So cute. Oh, I'm gonna have to swatch these. You know, I'm gonna leave them as a surprise. 
because there are a lot of them, seven of them. We have Nudie, Cherry Vanilla, Juicy Watermelon, Daisy Pink, Rosy Outlook, Velvet, and Maple Sugar. I'm gonna leave this for a dedicated video because there's a lot of them. I think I, I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna have to do videos with just the lip products to see how they look. <gasps> Thank you so much, Lawless. I am really excited. But what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try one of them just to see what the formula is. I'm gonna try Juicy Watermelon because I do love watermelon. How pretty, pretty packaging. And uh, let's look at the applicator. Oops, ooh. The applicator is pretty big. Mmm, smells like watermelon. Yes, I love it. I love watermelon. I know I said that already, but it's like a pretty pink. It's like so nice for like the spring and summer and gets really hot. Excited. Thank you so much again, Lawless, for sending me your products and all six shapes. Very generous of you. Thank, thank you so much. I got something from a brand that I don't recognize, but they sent me, uh, they asked me that I wanted to try some skincare supplements. It's the brand Imare. I'm gonna say that in French. Imare Beauty. It says, hey babe, we've been loving your content. We're so excited to share products with you. We hope you love them. They sent me the Marine Algae and Scolding and Vitamin C skincare supplement. These are things that you, you take, that you eat, like, like um, vitamins. And this is the Reishi and Shaga and Snow Mushroom hair care supplements. This is something that will take me longer to review, but you know, it's coming. So thank you, Imare. I'm, I'm curious to try anything that can improve my skin and the ingredients look pretty good because I do it, I did my research before accepting it. And their ingredients look pretty good. Um, I don't I don't see anything, any chemicals or anything like that. But I will give it a try, of course. I got something for L'Oreal, the Dark Spots Game Over. I did find funny that they had dominoes outside the box. Like my family loves playing dominoes. They sent me over their Bright Reveal Broad Spectrum SPF Daily SPS 50 Daily UV Lotion. Awesome again. I love trying sunscreen and SPF products. It reduces the appearance of dark spots, blends with all skin tones, no white cast, lightweight, non-greasy, fluid texture, and suitable for sensitive skin. Thank you, L'Oreal. Okay, I got a huge box from La Roche-Posay. They send me stuff every once in a while, so it's a lot of things. And I'm just going to go over briefly what they sent me. They sent me over the Daily Repair Moisturizing Lotion. They sent me the body washes. This, no, the Gentle Foaming Cleansing Oil. The Tolerain Dermal Cleanser. The Double Repair Face Moisturizer. I love this moisturizer. Some thermal spring water. Very refreshing, especially for this hot days of Miami. Vitamin C Serum. The Psychoplast Balm B5 Soothing Therapeutic Multi Purpose Cream. And this must be sunscreen. Yes, the 60 Body and Face Frost Spectrum SPF 60. Melt in Milk Sunscreen. So thank you so, so much La Roche-Posay for keeping me pap pampered, hydrating, refreshed, and all that during these hot months and all year. And I think that's it. That was a lot. I am tired. I hope this video isn't too long. I love PR videos and unboxing videos, and I hope you do too. I'm going to try to list as much as I can in the description box. And uh, I want to thank you for coming over and spending your time with me. Let me know which product you are more curious about, which one you want me to try first or show you first, let me know down below. If you had your personal a personal experience with any of these products or brands, also let me know. I want to hear everything. Again, thank you so, so much. It means the world to me because you could be doing anything else. And the fact that you're spending these minutes with me, I really do appreciate it. All this is mostly because of you guys, because of your support for watching me. If it weren't for you guys, I wouldn't be most likely not getting anything. Or almost anything so all this is for you guys so thank you so so much if you like this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't done so already and I'll see you next time bye